All right, today I want to talk to you about in whom your faith lays. And I say this because we are all born into this world and some people are born into famous families. Some people are not born into famous families and they become famous later. And I know that we all have been given gifts and talents from the one who created us and sent us here into this world. And when we don't know or understand the purpose that we've been given, sometimes if we're not careful, we are looking to others to get something from them that we already have from the same creator. Or we go about missing opportunities that we are to offer others because again, we're so busy trying to go and receive that which we already have and don't realize we have from someone else we think we need to get it from. So the perfect scripture for this is to really focus on Proverbs 3, 5 through 6, where it says, trust in the Lord with all your heart. Lean not to your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge him, being the Lord, and he will direct your path. So, how do you know which path to take? Well, go to the only one that can tell you. And you know what? Sometimes just going somewhere and sitting still and just being present is enough. When it comes to your assignment, no one else can do it better than you for that purpose because you're the one assigned to it. Although there may be others assigned to the same assignment, but your part is just as critical as someone else's. Know that you matter. Understand that if you are in this life, you matter. Some choices that you've made in the past may prohibit you from feeling that you matter, but you still do matter. And it's so important for you to understand this because your future is dictated upon decisions you make about how much you understand that you matter. But in that, it is so important to always be where you are assigned to be. And because God is God, He in, its, in Himself is the one who is the gifted one or, or offers the gifts in every person that we see gifts in. So make sure he gets the glory and the talents that is in every person, it comes from the same one. So before you are so quick to rush here and rush there and feeling like a certain person has what you need, understand the one who gave it to that certain person for you to receive that need. It still comes from the same source regardless. All the gifts, all the talents. God just uses different faces. But he's the producer of all the talents and the gifts. I hope these words have found you well. And until the next time you sit with me, God bless you. Enjoy your tea.